Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel if you are new here. My name is Blair, and if you are just now coming to my channel, um, I am 36 weeks pregnant, and this is our third baby. Uh, we have two girls, Avery and Alexis. This will be our first baby boy, and I'm so excited. So originally, we had planned on having a home birth this time. Um, I really wanted my girls to be here. I thought it would be just a very nice experience, but I get high blood pressure during my pregnancies. So my midwife and the doctor that I've been seeing, they think it's um, just a good idea if I am induced at 37 weeks. So I am getting induced on Sunday, Sunday evening. I'm so nervous, but I'm excited. So we have everything already that we need for baby. Um, Amazon was probably tired of coming to my house because we are getting like three deliveries a day, like for a couple days in a row. But we have everything now, so I'm happy. And while I am packing my hospital bag, I thought I would show you what I am bringing for me and for the baby. The first thing that we're bringing is the boppy pillow. So if you don't know what this is, it goes around you like this and you lay baby on it and it supports the baby while you're breastfeeding. And I love this cover, it is super soft and I love the arrows on it. If you haven't been able to tell, we love white and gray. I don't remember actually packing a hospital bag the last two times, to be honest. I don't even know if I wore like actual clothes at the hospital or if I just kept on the little gown thing. But this time I'm actually bringing clothes and if I can, I'm going to wear those instead. So I don't know how many nights we're going to have to stay there. So, um. I'm bringing some pajamas and I have some yoga pants and a shirt. I am bringing a sweater. I just bought this off Amazon. This is a nursing shirt. Ooh, I don't know if you can tell. It opens here. Yeah, I didn't have any nursing shirts for Avery and Alexis. So um, that's something that I wanted to buy, just some loose cute fitting shirts that made it easy while I'm nursing. This is just like a little loose fitting dress, probably for like when we come home or something. And I'm just bringing two long shirts with, to wear with um, my leggings. Oh, I'm bringing three pairs of leggings with me. I just bought these nursing bras off Amazon. So I'm bringing three different colors. I am bringing some socks. Um, I know that at the hospital they give you those like really big socks and they have the little things on the bottom so you don't slip. I don't know if these are gonna be too slippery. We're, we're gonna see. I might just end up wearing the other ones. All right, so I know that after you have a baby, they give you like this weird underwear it's like really stretchy and i don't know <laughs> i know they give those to you at the hospital but we just bought these so i'm gonna try to wear my own because at least they're cuter these were just little samples that my midwife um gave me um in here there's breast milk storage bags and nursing pads so I was just gonna bring those just in case and then this was just a little sample of nipple cream if your nipples get sore during breastfeeding all right so we have these after you have a baby usually you're like kind of sore down there so um these are good if you want to like put them in your pads that you have to wear after Okay, they're medicated cooling pads. 
it feels like really good down there if you're sore derm up last again if you're sore down there you just spray it and it feels really good <laughs> okay i ordered these bottles i remember using these with avery and alexis again you're sore so it kind of hurts to like wipe after you go to the bathroom so you fill this with water and you like just spray it down there instead of wiping the baby's grandma she made this blanket for him this blanket could not fit in his bag so i'm just keeping it in my bag i ordered this bag isn't it so pretty i love it all right so i'm gonna put all this in my bag and then next i'm going to show you what i am bringing to the hospital for baby jeremiah okay so i got all my stuff packed obviously i didn't show you obvious things like my phone charger my toothbrush hairbrush makeup if you want to feel cute while you're in the hospital all right so now i'm going to show you what is in baby's hospital bag isn't this diaper bag like the cutest like what it looks like inside I love it. All right, so I thought about bringing diapers and wipes, but I'm sure that the hospital is going to provide that. So I decided not to bring them, but I already opened a little pack of newborn diapers. Look how tiny they are. Are they not like the cutest things? Um, but at home we are going to be using cloth diapers, but we did get regular diapers also from people. Again, I don't really remember what I did with Avery and Lexi. I don't know if they're gonna want the baby to stay just in a diaper and swaddled up so they can like do their little checks and everything, or if they're going to let me put clothes on him. I'm not sure. So. I'm only bringing a couple of things. I'm bringing a newborn, like, little pajama set. And then this one is zero to three. We're bringing this outfit and this one with matching little pants. And I really wanted this to be his going home outfit. I think it's so cute. And it comes with these pants and a matching hat. I'm bringing two burp cloths. And then this is a swaddle blanket. It has arrows on it, just like his bobby pillow. I love it, and it's so soft. All right, so I don't think I need anything else. Hopefully, we don't need to stay in the hospital for too long. Um, My girls are going to stay with my mom while I'm in the hospital since they are not allowed in there right now, sadly. So they're going there tomorrow afternoon. And so me and my husband get like a whole day together. It's gonna be crazy because we're always with the girls. So we never get alone time. Alexis loves going to my mom's house, but Avery is like never away from me. So this is going to be the longest time I've ever been away from her. So I am really sad about that. I'm gonna miss her so much. I'm going to try to record as much as I can in the hospital. I don't really know what their policy is going to be, but you guys will be seeing my baby soon. <laughs> I'm so excited. The last time that we, that I got an ultrasound, um, I could see his cute little face and the ultrasound technician, she asked me if my other two babies had um chunky cheeks and i was like yes and you can see that he has them too and he's so cute and it kind of looks like he probably has like really dark long eyelashes so i cannot wait to see his cute face in person i'm so excited i haven't had a little baby around in like four years so mm, it's gonna be so different but i love babies so 
we are so excited so if you just found my channel um i mostly do like stay at home mom type videos day in the life videos we homeschool and obviously i'm gonna be having a newborn baby soon so if you like those videos then i hope that you decide to subscribe to our channel and join our youtube family thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys next time bye